What is up guys, it is Nick and we are back on MLB The Show 18, continuing the Boston Red Sox uh, franchise. 12-0 and are the Red Sox, 9-4 and are the Orioles, 8-5 and the Blue Jays, 3-9 and for the Rays, and 3-10 and for the Yankees. Yankees need to get it going, but we are going to be quick managing some games today. So the 9-4 and Orioles come to town to face Chris Archer. Chris Tillman against Chris Archer. Hop into this quick manage. Chris Archer gets to take the mound. Nunez will get the day off for Alan Hansen, who will get to debut. Tired, but he should be all right. Teoscar Hernandez will DH, and we're all set to go. Chris Archer to face Chris Gentry, or Craig Gentry to lead off the game, and he'll get him to ground out. Peterson strikes out. Machado grounds out. Mookie Betts grounds out. Bogarts and Benintendi follow suit ground out. Adam Jones strikes out. Mancini strikes out. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Chris Archer strikes out the side. A single from J.D. Martinez. Teoscar Hernandez. <sighs> oh, excuse me. Teoscar Hernandez flies out. Devers singles. Two on, one out. Hanson's first at bat as a Red Sox is a ground out. But advances the batters. Bradley walks. Bases loaded. Sandy Leone, and he'll fly out. Beckham. Pedro Alvarez is on. Chance Cisco though, double play, and Mookie Betts back up. He'll ground out. Bogarts, out. Benintendi, out. Craig Gentry is on. Gentry. Stays at first. Peterson strikes out. Machado flies out. Adam Jones strikes out. A solo home run for Rafael Devers, and it's 1-0 Boston. Alan Hansen up, and he'll strike out. Archer gives up a single to Scope. A strikeout. Alvarez strikes out, and Archer is dealing. Bradley Jr. walks. Leon wa er, flies out. Mookie Betts a strikeout. Bogarts a walk. Benintendi up. And he'll get hit by a pitch. Base is loaded for J.D. Martinez against Chris Tillman. And he'll fly out. A single to Jace Peterson. And a two-run homer to Manny Machado. And Archer gives up two earned in the top of the six. Adam Jones flies out. Teoscar Hernandez up. He'll ground out. Devers with a double. Hanson pops out. Jackie Bradley strikes out. Strikeout for Archer. He'll give up a single to Beckham to bring up Pedro Alvarez. Uh, I'm going to pull him. Carson Smith in. Carson Smith a single to Chance Sisko. Gentry sack bunts him over. Peterson a single, but Sisko unable to advance. Machado up, and Machado will walk. Bases load him for Adam Jones. He'll sack fly a guy in, and Mancini up. He'll strike out. Red Sox down two. Two innings to go. Michael Gibbons into the game, and he walks Benintendi. JD a double, and it's a one-run game. Teoscar Hernandez flies out. Devers a single, and we're all tied up in Boston. Hanson flies out. Bradley walks. Leone grounds out. Top ninth we go. Scope a single. Beckham a double and the lead is gone. A single and not a good inning for Carson Smith. Not a good inning at all and Carson Smith will be pulled for A.J. Ramos. Ramos gets out of the inning but it's still a three run game. Michael Gibbons to face Moogie Betts. Oh, no. Zach Britton is in. Britton walks Bogarts. And a double play by Benintendi for the first loss of the year for the Red Sox. Machado goes yard and a terrible inning for Carson Smith. Gives the Red Sox their first loss of the game. So Stroman will take the mound today. I guess Benintendi can DH. All right, so Stroman fly out. Stroman single to Machado, but no harm, no foul. Ground out by Mookie. Single by Bogarts, and he'll take a base. Walk by Benintendi. They will take two bases. And Tiasker Hernandez won't get them both home. But it's a one-run game. Stroman works a 1-2-3 second. This is why I don't like the computer. The play is Mookie because they don't get the hits. A two-run homer, and Machado goes yard in back-to-back -back games. Stroman does get out of the inning, but a little bit of issues for Stroman. Gentry pops out, though, and we are through 
about, we're through half the game, 2-1 Baltimore. Devers a single, Nunez a fielder's choice, and he'll take second. Bradley pops out, Leon grounds out. And a solo home run, Machado is just absolutely eating us up. Mookie grounds out, Mookie can't get a hit to save his life. Stroman gives up a run, and that'll be the end for Marcus Stroman. Joaquin Soria into the game. Now pitching for the Red Solo home run from Teoscar Hernandez makes it a two-run game off Alex Cobb. Devers will single. Nunez flies out. Bradley singles, brings up Leone. I'm going to pinch hit for Sandy Leone with Colton Wong, I think. No, we'll do it with Moreland. Number 18, Moreland. Mitch Moreland up. Bleeber. Didn't work out, but Mookie Betts back up 0 for 3 on the day, and he will triple to lead it off. Finally, Mookie Betts gets a hit in this Orioles series, and it's a triple. Bogart's a two-run homer, and we're tied at four. Ben Benintendi grounds out a solo home run by J.D. Martinez, and it's 5-4. to four. And that means it's time. So Edwin Diaz will get the first batter, and Kimbrell will get the last two. Number 39. So Edwin Diaz in and then Kimbrell now. Fly out and a strikeout. And that will be it. Joaquin Soria gets the win. Kimbrell his fist save. Blyer gets the loss. Ogart's the player of the game. A home run, two runs scored, two RBIs, and two stolen bases. Great day for Xander Bogarts. 13-1 are the Red Sox now. And it's Tyson Ross against Dylan Bundy. Uh... JD is DHing. How many games do we have in a row? Hold on, I gotta look at this. Okay, we got a lot, so it might be time to give Bogarts a day off. Because I, I, there might be a way to finagle this to get him to DH. So DH Bogarts. Shortstop for Nunez. Bradley off for the day. We'll let Alan Hansen play again. He can play third. JD. Yeah, we'll do it like that. All right. Gentry against Ross. Ground out. And through the first inning is Tyson Ross. Mookie Betts strikes out. Walk for Bogarts. Benintendi flies out. Bogarts will steal second. JD will double him in. It's 1-0 Red Sox. Gasper Hernandez grounds out. And we head top second. Two walks issued by Tyson Ross. Chance Cisco up now. And he'll fly out. Devers, Nunez, and Hansen go down in order. And then Joseph, Gentry, and Beckham go down in order. Leon, Mookie bets with a double. Bogarts grounds out. Mookie caught stealing third. Tyson Ross walks Machado. I don't really care about that. That's fine. Bases loaded on Tyson Ross. Crush Davis up. He'll strike out. Chance Cisco now with a chance. Tyson Ross will walk him. And then a ground out to end the inning. So it's 1-1. One, one. Ben Intendi strikes out. JD on by error. Tiasker flies out. Devers grounds out. Gentry, Beckham, can't get Machado. But he does get Adam Jones. We stay tied. Nunez flies out. Hansen walks. And Hansen's going to steal second off of Bundy. Leon flies out. Mookie grounds out. Two on, two out for Tyson Ross. Can he get out of the sixth inning? Caleb Joseph singles, and he can't. This will be his last batter, and he gets him to ground out. Single by JD. Tiasker singles. Devers up. He'll single, and we're all tied up again. Nunez up. He'll fly out. So that'll be it for Tiasker. Bring in... Bring in Ramos. Now pitching for the Red Sox. Number 42. AJ Ramos. Ramos gets quick three outs and hands it up. Leon doubles, Mookie up now, face Michael Givens. Mookie bets a two-run home run off of Michael Givens, and the Red Sox take the lead. Bogarts walks, and he's taken second. Benintendi strikes out, JD walks, Tiasker up, and he'll fly out. Time to go to the Monster. So Edwin Diaz and Kimbrell going to pitch again today. Now pitching for the Red Sox, number 42. 
Vince running at this number 42, Kobe Matthews. Can Edwin Diaz get out of it? He does! Edwin Diaz gives up two straight, uh, a walk and a single, but he gets out of the inning with no damage now done. For Baltimore, number 42, Brad Brock. Brad Brock works a 1-2-3 inning, and Kimbrell into the game. Kimbrell gets Beckham and Machado, and now Adam Jones grounds out, and that will do it. Mookie bets the go-ahead two-run homer in the bottom of the seventh, holds out as Diaz and Kimbrell get the hold and save. A.J. Ramos picks up the win, and Dylan Mundy takes the loss. Up next, Kevin Gaussman against Chris Sale in the series finale. Red Sox now 14-1. And... And I think we're good. All right, so Sale to face Gentry gives up a leadoff single. Fielder's choice out, fly out, and caught stealing. Mookie Betts leads off the game with a solo home run off of Kevin Gaussman. Other three go down in order and Sale back out. The Oscar leads it off with a double. Nunez strikes out. Try to steal third. Caught stealing. Like I said, we're going to try it. We're going to be stealing. A single by Mookie. Mookie caught stealing second. Didn't really think he'd get caught stealing second. Benintendi leads it off with a double. Tries to take third, and it's it's not going well. It's trying to steal against Kevin Gossman. We might we might be done trying to steal. Solo home run, Rafael Devers off of Kevin Gossman. Oh, and Nunez goes back to back. Then Bradley doubles. Mookie Betts now up, he'll ground out. Bogarts hit by pitch. Benintendi walks, bases loaded. JD Martinez, he'll just walk him in. Teoscar Hernandez up in a grand slam. Teoscar Hernandez. Seven runs for the Red Sox in the bottom of the fifth. Your attention, now pitching for Number 15. And this isn't over yet. Devers walks. Nunez strikes out. Sale, 1 2 3 inning, top of the six. Mookie walks. Mookie takes second this time. A walk from Bogarts. We're going to try to steal it all. Ah, uh, we didn't get it. All right, Chris Sale to face Machado, and Sale is not even remotely tired. And he picks him off. Oh my gosh, Chris Sale. JD Martinez goes yard. It's just a field day out here today. Bradley a single. The own pops out. The sale stay in the, stay in the game. A couple fielders choice outs and Mookie Betts is up. He'll pop out. Bogarts flies out. Um, do I want to leave? I'll just leave. Chris Sale can finish this game. Or maybe not. Strikes him out. Now just Jonathan Scope gets a ground out and Chris Sale goes complete game. Shut out. Ten strikeouts. Ooh, what a game! What a game that was. What were our stats in that game? So, 2 for 4 for Mookie, 0 for 3 for Bogarts, 1 for free, 1 for 4 for Benintendi, 1 for 3 for Martinez, 2 for 3 for Teoscar, 2 for 3 for Devers, 1 for 4 for Nunez, 2 for 3 for Bradley, and 0 for 4 for Leon. Great job, Sandy. <laughs> Betts and Hernandez got caught stealing twice and Benintendi once. Uh, Betts the only stolen base, but... uh. Doubles by Benintendi, Hernandez, and Bradley. Homers by Betts, Martinez, Hernandez, Devers, Nunez. Teoscar Hernandez, Grand Slam. That's so good. Sale 4 0 now. 106 ERA. And we head to a series with the Los Angeles Angels. Garrett Richards, David Price. Our guys are a little tired. I think it's time for a full sale sub today. Uh, Sandy Leon, you're going to have to play. But uh, Nunez, out. We'll adjust everything. Can Sandy Leon or Vasquez play anything else? They can't. Okay. Uh, Colton Wong, in. Devers, you got to get out for Hansen. wonder if Vasquez can play it. If Vasquez could, uh, that doesn't really help if he DHs because someone's going to get rest DHing anyway. Okay, so now we got to mess with. So Wong actually can play that. So let's just have Moreland play his actual position. Um, I 
I think we're good. We can let Mookie play outfield today. All right, I think we're good. Skip, I want to play Sandy today. Mookie grounds out. Bogart's a double. Benintendi strikes out. Fly out from JD. Here we go. David Price, not a good start. Pitch around Trout. Base is loaded on David Price and a sack fly. They catch Mike Trout stealing and then give up a single. All right, two to nothing. Colton Wong, Hanson, Moreland on, but nothing comes of it. Can't work the one, two, three, but gets gets the out. Strike out a triple from Ian Kinsler. Gets the pop out, but then gives up a single. Not a good day so far for David Price. And we cannot get anything going here. David Price continues to struggle, but gets through the inning. Leon, walk for bets. Bogart sack bunts him over. Base is loaded. J.D. Martinez, he'll single in two runs. Colton Wong now up. Wong fielder's choice. Hanson pops out, remains 3-2. Finally, Price works a 1-2-3 inning. A single from Moreland. Single from Bradley. Leone flies out. Mookie bets up. He'll double in two runs, and we take the lead on Garrett Richards. Hansel Robles gives up a two-run homer to Xander Bogarts. Walks JD, and Wong pops out. Price walks Cozart. Uh, okay. Oh, runner thrown out. Okay, hold on. We'll give him a chance to get out of this. Maldonado strikes out. Nick Tropiano into the game. And a double by Sandy Leone's going to bring up Mookie, who strikes out. That's going to be it for David Price. Um. Hmm. It's not a save opportunity, so we probably won't bring in Diaz or Smith or Kimbrel. We'll bring in Carson Smith. Yeah. Soria Ramos. Your attention, please. Now pitching for number 43. So Carson Smith finally works a 1 2 3 inning and Joaquin Soria into the game. Well, Joaquin Soria got screwed by an error. Hanson doubles. Walk from Moreland. Bradley strikes out. Leone double play. So now it's a save opportunity, so Kimbrel's coming in. Alright, Kimbrel. Okay, there we go. Good job, Kimbrel. Kimbrel gets a seventh save. Gives up his first earned run of the year. Uh, we'll take a look. We can take a look at what our pitching staff is doing. Hi, I'm Justin Allegri, and this is your Wednesday edition of Inside the Show. Looking first at the American League East, the Boston Red Sox ran okay. 13 hits in the Not game bad. as they pulled off the win. Kimbrel with a 1-1-3 ERA now. Five. All right, game two. Matt Shoemaker, Chris Archer. Sandy Leone has got to sit this game out. So get in there. And then Mookie can DH. And Benintendi can get the day off. Benintendi out. Colton Wong in. Anything else that I want to do? I think that's good. All right. Mookie singles to lead off the game. Bogart strikes out. Mookie caught stealing. Colton Wong getting a bat up in the order today and gets caught stealing. Archer works a nice inning. And it's a pitcher's duel through two innings. Nunez doubles. Two-run home run Jackie Bradley Jr. Mookie singles again. And this time he will take the base. But gets thrown out at home. Two walks by Archer. And a single. Gets a run in. Double play saves him. JD on. Tiasker, uh, fielder's choice. He'll get caught stealing. Solo home run, Justin Upton. And it's 2-2. Two two. Archer works through the fifth. Mookie flies out. And we're through six. 
Solo home run, J.D. Martinez off a of Matt Shoemaker. It's 3-2 Boston. Now pitching for the Angels, number 33, Jim Johnson. So Jim Johnson is no earned runs, comes into the game, and there's a man on second and third, nobody out for Jackie Bradley, who will walk. Bases loaded, Christian Vasquez is going to pop out. Bases loaded, Mookie bets, and he singles in two runs. Fly out from Bogarts, but it's 5-2 now. Archer still in the game. Double play. Hansel Robles can't get out of this and gives up another run. A walk. Base is loaded for Vasquez and he'll walk. Here we go. Base is loaded. Mookie bets once again and he doubles in all three runs. Steals third base and then ground out. But that'll do it. Edwin Diaz is going to get some work now. So Colton Wong walks. J.D. Martinez, the playing left field today, will actually get pulled for... Let's let Sandy Leon pinch hit. And Leon gets a hit. Uh, Teoscar... Teoscar out for Moreland. Why is Robles still in the game? Runner thrown out, really. He got bailed out by that. Jose Alvarez into the game, and Hanson will ground out. So Edwin now Diaz batting. will not be the one completing this game. It will be Hirano. Now pitching for Boston, number 66. So Hirano finishes the game off, an 11-2 win for the Red Sox. Eduardo Nunez, 4 for 5, 3 runs, 2 RBIs, 2 doubles, and 2 stolen bases. Is this the final game of the series? Yeah, final game of the series against the Angels. We are 17-1. Stroman takes on Andrew Haney. Um, Xander could use a day off. So that means Jackie Bradley gets the day off. Four. Let's get Mitch Moreland out here. Mitch Moreland can actually play the outfield. I don't think I need him to. Eh, maybe I maybe I can. I can let him do this. Oh, JD can't be playing shortstop. Okay, and then Nunez. Switch all that around. Everybody back to relatively normal positions. Alright. Mookie flies out. Bogarts flies out. Benintendi grounds out. Stroman against Trout, and he gets him to fly out. Single from JD. Single from Teoscar. Nunez on by error, and its base is loaded for Devers, who sack flies. So Nunez is going to take second. Moreland up. He'll ground out. Vasquez grounds out. And relatively good escape job from Heaney. Single by Mookie. Fielder's choice by Bogarts, and a double play. I knew I should have stole. And Stroman, a little struggles here. Kinsler, a three-run home run, and Stroman rocked here in the second or in the third walk to Nunez and Nunez actually got caught stealing walk to Moreland bets up he'll single but a strikeout ends that threat Stroman gets a pop out and a fielder's choice out to get out of that inning Stroman gets gives up a walk single to Calhoun Martin Maldonado grounds out good. Solo home run Devers brings us within two. Moreland singles, a single from Vasquez. Mookie up, face Jim Johnson. So bases are loaded now against Jim Johnson and Bogart singles, so it's a one-run game. Benintendi. Jose Alvarez. Benintendi now. Base is loaded. He'll sack fly and we're all tied up. Bogarts will take second for JD and JD will walk. Base is loaded. T. Oscar Hernandez and he'll get hit by the pitch. Red Sox take the lead. Eduardo Nunez base is loaded and he'll get hit by a pitch. Jose, what are you doing? Devers now. Base is loaded. Fielder's choice out but it's a two run lead and that'll be it for Marcus Stroman. AJ Ramos into the game. Now pitching for Boston. Number 44. Ramos works the 1-2-3 inning. 
Mookie bets a solo home run, and it's a three-run game. Bogart's on with a single. He'll steal a base. Benintendi scores him. I'll end that threat. Edwin Diaz now checks into the game. Diaz, Diaz struggling a little here, but gets the strikeout, ends the threat. Now pitching for the Angels, number 53, So, save opportunity here for Craig Kimbrell. And he'll get it. Kimbrell records his eighth save. Stroman gets the win. Luckily, lucky for Stroman, he gets the win. Mookie Betts, player of the game. Jim Johnson, the loss. Three for four for Mookie. Great game for Mookie, and the Red Sox are 18 and one. So we'll complete the Oakland A's series here. Let's take a look a little more at our our TGIF, team as a whole. And welcome to Inside the Show. Looking first at the American League East. I wish this guy Sox wouldn't talk. Had 12 hits as a team as they pulled off the win against the Angels in Orange County, eight to five. Okay, are you done talking? Okay, so Mookie, JD, and Xander have played every game. Teoscar's played all but one. Benintendi's played all but two. And then we've got a kind of mismatch of everybody else that's played games. So, Mookie has taken the most at-bats by nine. Seems kind of crazy to me. Um, he has the most hits by nine. Um, he has eight home runs. JD has 12. Four for Xander and Bradley and Teoscar. Three for Rafael and Eduardo, one for Benintendi and Wong, none for Moreland, Vasquez, Hanson, or Lee Own. 30 RBIs for JD, 29 for Mookie, 15 for Teoscar, 13 apiece for Jackie Bradley and Bogarts, a 10 for Benintendi. Stolen bases, 14 for Xander Bogarts, 9 for Nunez, 8 for Betts, 6 for Benintendi. Mookie still hitting 460, 397 for Xander, 383 for Devers, 373 for Moreland, 358 for Teoscar, uh, 342 for JD, 333 for Vasquez, 316 for Wong, 314 for Jackie Bradley, 304 for Nunez, and then the, the bad three. 83 for Hansen, 184 for Leone, and 280 or 246 for Benintendi. Oops, was not done with that. On base, Mookie has the highest on base, but uh, Xander has taken far more walks. 472 on base for him. Moreland. OPS, Mookie has a 1432 OPS. Mookie's only taken three walks this year, which is far lower than any other t player on our team. Uh, let's see. Benintendi has struck out the most. Mookie has 15 doubles and two triples. 83 total bags already. Um, caught stealing five times already. That's not great, but, um, Mookie has a 2.0 war and Bogarts is a 2.1 war. All right, let's take a look at our pitchers. So Carson Smith is the only guy with a loss. Soria and Ramos have wins as relievers. Archer, Stroman have three. Ross has two. Sale and Price have four apiece. Sale is pitched seven more innings than anybody else Amir Garrett Ramos has yet to issue a walk that's interesting strikeouts 39 for sale 29 for Archer kind of what I would expect here Stroman not that many Diaz has 16 and only 10 innings pitched it's pretty impressive ERA zero still for Ramos exactly one for Kimbrell sale 107 203 for Archer I'm good with anything under a three for most of these guys Crap, I hit over again. Whip. Carson Smith has just been absolutely terrible. I might actually look to trade him. I mean, I like... I like kind of the pitchers that I have, and I don't, I don't really know what kind of yield I can return on this. Can I yield something great? Uh, in terms of prospects, not really. I could really use another bat. So... I would take I would take my boy Sergio Romo wherever he is. Sergio Romo is their closer. He's considered their closer, really. Really, Sergio Romo is considered your closer. Did they trade Colombe? The heck is Colombe? All right. Um I could really use another reliever. Or a right-handed bat. 
wish there was a more detailed way that you could look for relievers or look for certain things that you wanted. Yeah, we could, give me Josh Hader. Um, I don't know. None of these relievers are doing anything for me. Ross Stripling is a re reliever in this. Uh, you could give me Mark Melanson. Oh my gosh, Mark Melanson is making a ton of money. Carson Smith is making a bunch of money in comparison. I would take Miguel Castro. They do the deal, Miguel Castro for Carson Smith. I understand Castro is like not as good and he's a lot younger, but I would take him. Um, Stellan Patanza is still struggling in this series. Yeah, he's got six and two, he's got a six point two three. So the Yankees and Red Cox could sh could swap struggling relief pitchers. Man, there's just like no relief pitchers out here. I mean, I would take Robles off their hands. I mean, he's been bad. I mean, what what would it take? What do you guys want for Robles? They would take Workman and okay, I'll do it this way then. Jordan Betts. All right. Send you Jordan Betts and Ryan Workman for Hansel Robles. And then we'll trade Carson Smith off. We'll pawn him off to someone. I would like a hitter, I guess, back. Like a right-handed bat. I think we already looked at this and there's like not that many options. You want to give me Odor? You can give me Beltre? <laughs> uh, Ozzy Elbies. I don't know why I said Ozzy Albies like that, as if they were going to give me Ozzy Albies. They really do hate Cesar Hernandez. Like, the Phillies literally hate Cesar Hernandez in this series. Or in this game. Slide me. That would mean someone would go to the bench, right? Because <laughs> that would mean Nunez would go to the bench hitting. Hitting 304. But I could make this trade for Cesar Hernandez. I mean, I think it makes sense. We need bats. He's better than Nunez. I'm not going to stunt Devers by... I mean, he's got he's better than Devers or, or Nunez. He's younger than Nunez. I think it just makes sense. To me, it just makes sense. He's better than than Nunez. In real life, Nunez is not an everyday player. I don't know why he expects to be an everyday player. So I think I'm going to make this trade for Cesar Hernandez. So Carson Smith for Cesar Hernandez. And I mean, I would trade Nunez. I mean... He's mad because he's on the bench. His overall go up. What is he batting this year? Hold on. What's he batting this year? He's batting 362. I just traded for a 362 hitter. Like, what kind of offers do you get for Eduardo Nunez? Tim Beckham and Trumbo. I don't really have room for those guys. <laughs> they give me Sergio Romo. <laughs> I could get my boy Sergio Romo. Um, will you give me prospects, Rays? You down to send me, like, some prospects? I doubt it. Like, that doesn't make any sense, but... Wow, they actually value Sergio Romo. They actually value Yanni Chirinos. Uh, probably just have to hold on to Nunez. Okay. So, this kind of messes everything up, because now Cesar Hernandez has to bat in front of people. Six is about as best as I'd bat him. Okay, the no DH doesn't really matter. I like how I have my no DH set up.
I guess no DH Eduardo Nunez can play over Cesar. He's pr he's probably pissed. How pissed is he now? That he, minus 10 morale because he's on the bench. He's just satisfied being on our team. Cesar, what is your stealing looking like? Yeah, you're not bad. You're not Eduardo Nunez, but you're not bad. Okay. I think we're good. Cesar also provides a lot of flexibility, third base and shortstop. Nunez is outfield. It's third base and shortstop, but I don't need him in the outfield. We got five outfielders. That doesn't really matter. But Nunez will give us some flexibility to do some different things. So I like it. I like it. We're good. We acquired we acquired a couple of interesting pieces. Um, Robles will be interesting. Ramos can move to more of a setup guy now. But I far prefer this team. Smith was just not doing it for us. Maybe he'll help out another team, but man, he was just absolutely sucking on our team. So Cesar Hernandez will actually not play today. It will be Nunez because Cesar is tired. Probably already played today. That's probably what it is. But here we go. Mookie pops out. Hit by pitch. Bogart's taking the base. In already. Caught stealing. Strikeout. Tyson Ross. A nice inning. Teoscar. He'll steal a base. Nunez gets caught stealing. Solo home run by Crush Davis. By Mini Crush. Stolen base by Jonathan Lucroy. Really? Double Mookie. Oh, Tyson Ross is on the struggle bus. There we go. Benintendi on by error. And a bunch of fielder choices out. Hit by pitch. Okay, good. We're through four. Oakland takes the lead, three to one. Mookie's on with a single. Bogarts flies out. Mookie takes second. JD double play. Single for Nunez. He'll take second. And two strikeouts. So now we gotta pull Ross. Can't play Robles. It's gotta be Soria. Now pitching for the Red Sox, number 48, Good job by Joaquin Soria. Liam Hendricks gives up the lead. JD singles in two runs. We're all tied up. So now it's interesting because now we're going Hirano Garrett. Number 66, now pitching for the A's. Number 39, Blake Hyman. So we're still tied, and Garrett will try to keep it that way. Amir Garrett did keep it. Mookie Betts solo home run. Red Sox up 4-3 to three in a game that seemed kind of dire. Mookie Betts solo home runs, and we're up. Benintendi steals a base. JD walks. Strikeout. And now it's time for Craig Kimbrell. Kimbrell double to Chris Davis. Well, Kimbrell, you got to get Mark Canna out, and he gets him to ground out. Craig Kimbrell picks up his ninth save. Amir Garrett gets the win. Mookie Betts, stolen base, homer, and like a single or something. Blake trying in the loss on the Mookie Betts solo homer. And the Red Sox are now 19-1. and Chris Sale to face off against Sean Manaya. Um, I think we're going to give... JD can DH, so he doesn't actually have to take the day off. We're going to let Mookie DH, so Xander will get his first day off. Nunez will get to play again today. Um, Moreland, get in there. Mitchie, get in here. You can play for Tiasker. Okay, so now I gotta set this up. So JD, we have too many outfielders. Nunez can play outfield. Or center. Oh no, Jackie Bradley's good. We're, we're, we're good. So first base for Moreland, second for Cesar, third for Nunez. Cesar will bat second. Then Nunez, Moreland. Okay, I like that. I like that. That's that's what we're doing. Let's do it. Mookie leads it off. Solo home run off of Sean Manaya. And it's 1-0. Chris Sale on the mound. And 1-0 might be good enough for Chris Sale. Caught stealing. 
Sale gives up a double to Canna, but strikes him out, and we're through two. Wong is single, and Colton Wong will take off. Mookie Betts flies out. A triple from Cesar Hernandez. Cesar Hernandez making himself known in his first game with the Red Sox. Three quick outs. JD singles. Moreland, Moreland and Nunez strike out, and a fielder's choice out, and we head bottom four. Sale makes quick work of him. Colton Wong stays hot. Solo home run for Colton Wong. Mookie Betts grounds out, and we head bottom fifth. A walk by Sale and a run is in on Chris Sale. Red Sox still lead. Benintendi on. He'll take a base. Walk to Moreland, and then a strikeout. Semyon singles. Fowler double play and a flyout. Now pitching for the athletic. Mookie Betts goes yard again off of Ryan Dahl. A double by Cesar Hernandez and a strikeout by Benintendi. Sale continues to work, not even close to being tired as Sale looks to go complete game shutout. So, Chris Sale could go complete game shutout, but Craig Kimbrell will come in for the save and completes it easily. Number 46, Craig Kimbrell. Kimbrell picks up his 10th save, and the Red Sox take a 2-0 series lead against the A's. Andrew Triggs now to face David Price. 20-1 and are the Boston Red Sox. 20-1. This is absolutely ridiculous. Cesar is tired, but let's play our whole lineup today. We get a break tomorrow, so full lineup. Mookie Betts walks. He'll take second. A single from Bogarts, and it's 1-0. Caught stealing. Three. Fowler? Okay. Walk to Devers in a line out. Price in a little bit of trouble. A three run home run. Chad Pinder. David Price behind in the game. The Red Sox unable to really pick him up. Solo home run Matt Chapman and it's 4-1. to one. Devers answers back with a solo home run. It's 4-2. to two. Bradley on. Mookie up. He singles. Bogart strikes out. Benintendi strikes out. David Price working efficiently now through five. But three straight strikeouts and an error to put Chad Pinder on. But a double play. We head top seven. Single from Bradley. Double play. David Price surrenders seven earned now. And that will be the hook. Bring in... Hmm. Let's bring in Ramos. He hasn't pitched in a while. Mookie Betts strikes out and just not a good day for the Red Sox. Down five runs. Bring in Garrett. Alright. I'm going to enter the game. This is the final game we're doing on this episode. I'm going to enter the game. We're going to try to save... Save the one loss. We'll head to our we'll head to a break at twenty and two if I lose this. We're already thirteen games up on the Rays. The Yankees have kind of turned around. They were three and ten, gone six and three since. Twenty and one. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the A's, number forty-four, Brent Hatcher. All right, here we go. Gonna have to string a lot of runs together here. Walks would be appreciated, Hatcher. I would much appreciate some walks. And JD. Ah, oh, fly out. Jasker Hernandez up now. One down. And he'll swing through a fastball. The 0 1 is a fastball, low. Hatcher trying to close this one out. And this one fouled off a splitter. The 0 2 pitch to Tiasker Hernandez. And this one lightly grounded. Won't be able to beat this one out, and that's out number two. Cesar Hernandez. 
Cesar Hernandez up now, 7-2. to two. And a fastball way outside, and Cesar waves at it. The 0-1 slider, a really nice slider there by Hatcher. And a slider curves inside, and that is strike three. Athletics will get the win, dropping the Red Sox to 20 and 2. David Price gives up seven earned. Probably left him in the game too long, but I don't think so. I think he should have been able to work through that and, and, and get it. But that will uh, that will do it for this episode. We'll take a quick look. We'll advance the day. And we'll advance it one more time to uh, our matchup against the Toronto Blue Jays. Um, we'll take a look real quick at our stamina for this. Uh, so Everybody looks pretty good except Cesar Hernandez. Do we get another quick day off soon? No. No, it's a while before we get another day off. Um, let's see here. Let's take a look at our stats heading into this end of this episode. So, for batting average, Mookie, three, 455, 384, Devers crushing, Cesar Hernandez. I mean, look at all these guys over 300. Vasquez at, at pretty much at 300. Benintendi is struggling mightily. Might give him a couple games off uh, in, in the next uh, set of games. Might give him the Toronto series off or something like that. See if he can get himself right. Um, ERA, Robles obviously sucked, and David Price sucked the last game, so he'll have to turn it around. Ramos and Kimbrel. I like where our ERAs are at. Ramos, Kimbrel, Sale, Soria, Herbano actually has turned his around after after giving up a run in his first start of, or first uh, playing time of the year. He actually has turned it around. Chris Sale has two complete games and two shutouts. Blown saves by Diaz and Robles. Price has given up 15. Robles has given up 13 home earned runs. So we'll try to get a little bit of it turned around for uh, David Price in the next episode. Maybe we'll play that game in the next episode. Uh, he doesn't pitch. He doesn't pitch until the Tampa Bay series. We're definitely not playing Tampa Bay again. But that's going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you have it. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode of the, M or of the Boston Red Sox franchise. Peace out.